This is the Hello World Podcast. You brought us back again to the basics. The pitfall of too many salespeople is being product oriented. Um, no offense meant to. I know that there are some um, consultative sellers out there. I'm not throwing some terminology there. A lot of stereotypes entered in here in the Philippines that if you speak so well, if you can present a product, you are good in sales. Okay? Uh, and that now has uh, this presents, or sorry, this current situation now presents the shift in skills that the Edward said you have to get, get attention and you can't get attention just by focusing on the uh, on our products. I think, so I think Edward, Edward go ahead. Uh, yeah, I think we've we've become consultants. We're consultants. Now. Mm-hmm. That's the difference. You know, we're we're not product salesmen, we're consultants. Mm-hmm. It's been there for the longest time. Yeah. Now we really need to embrace it just yeah. like technology has been a lot of us have been forced to adapt to technology. We should be forced to adapt to, you know, uh, a body of knowledge that has long been existing there. We yep. just don't. And here in the Philippines as well, selling before has been mostly based on relationships. I'm sure that you've uh, you've had yeah. an experience of that, Edward. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we know the client anyway. The client will not leave us. No, the client will renew, and people will get relaxed, and all of a sudden. Even if the friendship is there or the relationship is there, business is business. Very much so. And it happens. And it's going to happen more and more, you know, um, especially now when purses are tight, budgets are tight, you know. Um, uh, you know, And I see it happening with friends where they get the, the phone call or the email saying, you know, dear John, you will always be a good friend. However, you know, the business relationship cannot continue. Um, and that's how it is, you know. Yes, that used to exist before, but I think now that's going to that's going to accelerate. And that's not a bad thing. I don't think mm-hmm. that's a bad thing at all. It just means it, it's on us um, to do our job better, more professionally, and to continue to to give value to the customers we have mm-hmm. and the prospects we have, so that that we can retain their business. Mm-hmm. So yes, my insight here is. The, the tools, the principles have been there they have. for quite a while. They have. Yeah. You know, I think it's just that now we really have to apply them. Hi, this is Louis Banta, CEO and Chief Consultant of LJMB or Learning Just Made Better. Thanks for watching my video. To get more videos like this, click subscribe and hit the bell icon below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and share this to others.